Lucan. One of the better products to come out of the Halifax High School system in recent years joins me now. John, I guess if there's any good news, it is that the uh, uh, state of X got inside the 20 a couple of times in the last five minutes and came away dry. Yeah, that's about the only good, good news in the first half. Uh, you know, if we can if, if uh, we can keep them out the next half and if we can put some points on our board, it's going to be all right for us. John, what was the game plan coming in against St. Francis Xavier? What were you hoping you'd be able to do against them? We want to run the ball against them. Uh, this year, everyone seems to think that we have a really good passing you know, offense, and uh, I've been saying that, too. I said an article in the paper last last week against Acadia, and I had to eat crow on it because they uh, kept us just about nine, 5 for 28 last week. So we want to come out today and, and uh, run the ball against them as much as we can. And we, and we have been successful doing it, but we got to mix the passing in, too. How much are you hurting with the loss of Jeff Watts? Uh, a lot. Uh, Jeff, in his in the one game he did play, he had 90 yards on uh, eight carries, and he didn't have any big games. They they all averaged out. You know, he uh, ran you know 10, 10, 15, 20 yards every carry. He, he was great for us. One of the things I wanted to talk to you about was uh, the difference having Craig McKinnon in there as opposed to Terry O'Brien as a pass receiver. Do you notice a difference? Uh, are you is your number called more often when Terry is in there than when Craig is playing quarterback? Yeah, I don't want to take anything away from Craig. It's uh, two different type of quarterbacks. Uh, Craig, Craig, Craig's a roll-up quarterback, whereas, Ter- whereas Terry's a straight drop-back quarterback. And maybe an inside receiver, most of my patterns are uh, in the middle. Whereas, where, where if uh, Terry was uh, the quarterback, he would, he would be looking more more into the middle out. And when Craig's in there, he's he's looking out and then into the middle. And he's usually rolling out. So by the time he gets to the sidelines, and no one's open. He's got to throw it away or step out of bounds. He's it's uh, kind of hard for him to look downfield. Three touchdowns down with 30 minutes to play. Can you come back? What is it going to take? Yeah, I think we can come back. I think just the fact that we stopped in there is a good indication that, that we got a little bit of a roll now. If we can go in and we can get ourselves psyched up in the halftime, we should be able to come back. I wish you luck. Hope's a good ballgame. Thank Thanks you very much. By. Thank okay. you. John Lucan from the Huskies of St. Mary's. Position Tuppy. They have the ball on the 12-yard line. A driving wind at their backs. McKinnon with a good rush from the outside. Steps up and completes it to John Lucan. Lucan brought down around the 19-yard line. McKinnon now with a second down and nine. McKinnon out of the backfield, making the reception and driving ahead for a first down. Number 21, John Lucan. I, I like this McKinnon, Michael. Uh, he's uh, had some uh, things that's happened to him that's been a little discouraging, but uh, he's, uh, like I said, at the end of the second quarter, he threw the ball well, and uh, he's throwing it well now. He has to have time. You know, no one can throw the ball uh, when you're flat on your back. If you give him time, he can throw it. That middle, let's see if they come with a blitz. McKinnon throws it over the middle to John Lucan, who made a diving catch. An excellent pass there from McKinnon and a fine reception. That's just an excellent reception because uh, Lucan had to leave his feet to catch that ball, and it's just a perfect throw. Uh, right now, he, put, he needled it. It's like getting that eye and that needle. Watch this. Step up. Good technique. See that feet and shoulder to lift that ball? Threw it right between two defenders. Excellent throw and catch.